Well, the second year of the Palaszczuk government is off to a shaky start. Opinion polls show dwindling voter support and that key piece of legislation targeting alcohol fueled violence is far from certain to pass through Parliament. The opposition's accused Anastasia Palaszczuk of being a do-nothing Premier, but she says 2016 will be a year of delivery. I spoke with the Premier earlier. Premier, thanks for your time. One year in office and according to the opinion polls out this weekend, the honeymoon is well and truly over for Labor. Can I ask you for a frank assessment as to why you think support for you and your government has dropped? Well, I think, uh, Jess, look, we are working extremely hard. It's been one year on. Uh, we've got uh, ministers that are engaged, that are enthusiastic. We're delivering on our election commitments. And this year, we're going to see a year of delivery. And why do I say that? Because there's nothing more important than delivering frontline services right across the state. What about delivery in terms of the economy? There was a survey out this week by Commerce Queensland pointing to a drop in confidence and pointing specifically to the perceived inaction of the government over the last 12 months. What are your plans there? We have seen 60,000 jobs created in just over one year. What we've been concentrating on the first year is putting in place the building blocks. And the building blocks are about putting back skilling Queenslanders for work, making sure that we're restoring TAFE, making sure that young people have the opportunity to get into work. But at the same time, we have to diversify our economy. We can't do this alone. We're talking to the private sector. We're exploring new markets overseas. You mentioned 60,000 jobs that have been created, but more than 20,000 have been lost in the resources sector over the last two years. What are you going to do to arrest that? We've already accelerated more than $300 million worth of projects. Now, you may ask me about uh, what does this acceleration mean? Well, I sat next to um, uh, people from the Civil Contracting Association just yesterday, and they said to me, Premier, they said, Anastasia, the best thing about bringing those works forward is that we've got projects ready to go. We can put people into jobs straight away. It's time to drive to the next step, drive the economy, kickstart it. Are you prepared to consider any royalties relief for the resources sector? Uh, well, we're going to sit down with Michael Roach, but uh, my government is not in the business of giving money to private enterprise. I made that very clear with um, Queensland Nickel. We are looking at other options. But also, too, I might say that uh, there have been a number of um, companies uh, coming through my door talking to me about new opportunities. So, you know, I think we will see an uplift in the mining sector in the years to come. A number of reviews on some contentious issues are due to be finalised this year, things like uh, bikies, the taxi industry. Are you prepared to make some, some tough decisions, some potentially politically unpopular decisions? Well, we, of course I'm always prepared to make tough decisions, but uh, I will do them uh, with the community's support. You can't please everybody all the time, though. Well, at the moment, we have um, some legislation going through next week about alcohol, um, curbing alcohol fueled violence. Um, I don't want to see any more tragedy. I don't want to see any more deaths. We can be bold and do something.